And hello guys, welcome back to Let's Play Last Stop. I'm going to dive back into Mina's story now. Domestic Affairs, Chapter 3. Secrets and Lies. I'm curious about her Previously work um, place. It's a very interesting uh, place that she works at. Hey Dad! What ah, that was this? Wendy. Who sold this to you? Calls himself Spider. Very easy to find. We doing business or what? So she's yeah, Felix's daughter. You've got bare bad things coming your way. Ah, the, that drug dealer. I've got a feeling that that guy is gonna turn up again. <laughs> There's gonna be repercussions because we kind of attacked him. <clears throat> You really should do this more often. I can't do this again. Are you still doing this, I mean, Mina? A moment. I didn't mean right this second. I mean this. Us. What, what do you mean? It's... Come messed on. up. <laughs> I didn't really think this was going I don't know if she can just go home to her family and look at them straight. I've got to get going. I'm late for an appointment. Okay. Well, can I meet you for a coffee sometime? I don't know. This all seems a bit rushed. I'll send you a text or something. Got to run. So she's trying to put it off. So she's got a bit of a conscience. <laughs> but... So that is Dan that we saw on the street in um, Donna's story. So he's a teacher. <coughs> Mina's sort of like the most interesting one in a way. Because... You don't really like her at first. She's painted in a bad light. Okay, how are we doing? Am I late? Yeah, uh, but we're um, an apology would be nice. We're finding out about her. Um. Sorry. Work. Come on, let's go in. Dan has got the short straw, though. <laughs> Mrs. Hughes, it's lovely to have a chance to talk to you both at last. Late. He's always getting blown off. I'm so sorry we were held up. <sighs> How's Dylan doing, Mrs. Adelaide? Hey, is it? Tomorrow, please. Adelaide? Sorry, I think this Wait, is that's Donna's time. name. Is that Would Donna's like mum? Pleased to meet you, Mina. Dylan's progress this term has been good. He's blossoming into quite the artist. Mm. Yeah, that must be Donna's mum. Sorry. Gotta take this. Oh, it's uh, him from work. Played my afternoon. Don't let me down. <laughs> okay, what were we talking about? Uh, well, as I was saying, Dylan has a, a keen interest in drawing. Sorry, oh. that's me again. Mina. This is pretty bad, Mina. It's fine. You two continue. She's really taking a work over a family. <clears throat> well, I'm sorry if I don't know every detail of our son's life. Does that make me a bad parent? It kind of does. <laughs> when your kid's that age, you should pretty much know everything about them. For Christ's sake, Dan, it's my job. What do you want me to do? Quit and become what? A teacher? You think we can afford to live in that house on two teachers' salaries? Get real, Dan. I'm providing for this family. Don't throw that at me. I'm not asking for the world. I just want some extra help. I'm off. You can continue this on the way home. If you now can. she's being selfish. Because she's um, going behind everyone's back as it is. 
but then she's saying it's Dan's fault. I tried calling the office earlier. They said you'd left for the day. Well, I don't know why they'd say that. The receptionist doesn't... Yeah. This relationship's about to explode. Let's hear it. He's right there. She really does excuse any behaviour. <laughs> I suppose she's a narcissist. Um, get that one. Can we go out? Eat your muesli. And then can we go out? No promises. Not till that bowl is empty. Even the grey bits. Especially the grey bits. This looks like rabbit food. Can we go to the park then? Or maybe Mum would like to take you. Okay. Like Is she actually gonna yeah. spend some time with your son? Come on then. Thanks. Yeah, so this is obviously the same park the that um that Jack were in. What does that mean? Of course. Oh you can Ah oh, the damn phone. Turn your phone off. Please authenticate. Hughes four seven Alpha Tango. What's up? Harlequin. Amaret has left a memo here asking for your authorization on the Munich document. He's saying you must have forgotten. Can I have some? I money? can't send it off without someone's signature. Tell Amrit he can authorise this himself. He should know. I explained this to him on Wednesday. I Mom, tried are you listening? We need this out today. Mum! Just a moment, Dylan. Look, forget it. I'll come by the office and sort this out myself. Right, I need to take you home. But we only just got here. I'm sorry, I can't <coughs> stay. I've got to head into work. Oh, uh, you always say that. Fine. She's got a very it. demanding job. Yeah. I'm sorry, Tom. Are you mad with me? What even is your job? I've told you before, haven't I? No. All I know is that it's something to do with lying to people. I don't really know what she does, like. That workplace is kind of strange. Dad says you keep a lot of secrets. So, what is it? I could get in a lot of trouble. Why can't you just tell me? Fine. I work for a British private military security and intelligence company. My job is to monitor, support and execute orders for our investigators out in the field. The data is brought home to be analysed, packaged up and returned to the client. Usually a government or private interest. How's that? That doesn't sound very fun. Sounds Ask me again pretty uh, important. Sounds boring. <sighs> Any ideas what you want to do when you grow up? I want to be a teacher, like Dad, and help people. You can do better than that. What are you? What did you just say? Nothing. I just want to go home. Look, you've got your whole <coughs> life ahead of you to figure out what you want to do when you grow up. I'm just trying to help you. Fine! I don't want to talk about it anymore. I want to go home. Yeah, so she's proud of a job. But she's an awful parent. Somebody knows. It's all gonna blow up in your face, Mina. You can only be an awful person for so long. Oh, that's it. That one, that one was really short. Um, what time are we on? Yeah, that one were only t um, that one were only ten minutes, folks. So 
I'll actually do a double episode, so I'll jump into Donna's uh, Chapter 3, Friend or Foe. Yeah, that ended way earlier. <coughs> Most of the episodes have been a good um, 20 to 30 minutes, which is uh, perfect. Thank you, friend. What was that? Come a little closer. Ash, I need to get Emma. Please, Ash. This one's Stop getting interesting now. I can explain everything. So we, um, yeah, we don't know what he did. When he um, he got rid of her phone, didn't he? <coughs> Friend or fur, I guess they're uh, referring to him, the stranger. We don't know his name, do we? Even. Pick his clothes. Uh, kind of summary. Uh, go for that one. We got your dates tonight, then. No idea where she's gonna take me though. Nice to see you put ah, that is her from the school. Yeah. Had enough of being single. Tamara, so <laughs> it's funny how she's talking about she's just Emma's appeared. A lovely girl out tonight. I should probably get ready for work. I bet she gets boiling hot in that police outfit. Good luck, Em. What's her name again? Hazel. Who? What happened to Hazeling? Sounds fancy. She's from Croydon. <laughs> Croydon. <coughs> you doing okay, Mum? I'm okay. I'm, I'm just gonna have a little lie down. I don't think I've fully woken up yet. You all right? Of course, I'm. Just one of my wobbles. <laughs> oh dear. She's not very well. <coughs> so, Hazel, eh? Let's go for a walk. I need to talk to you about something. Who? What happened to Asling? Am I missing something? I'm worried about Mum. Did she just drop her? <laughs> for this... Uh... Stop overreacting. She just lost her balance, Hazel. that's all. Mum is really going to need our help from now We've both got to pull through for her. Good job. Donna, I mean it. I don't want to see you staying out with your friends all night anymore. I'm not out all night. I'm not trying to have an argument. Please just promise you'll spend some time with Mum this evening. You're not telling me something. At least she's been more civil with us. I think it's probably best you know what's going on. Okay. <coughs> Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. <sighs> Mum's not well. Hmm. I could see that. Sounds fine to me. She's been having some tests and they've not come back great. What do you mean not great? Alright. I'm gonna be late for work. Yeah, back to the, but the problem is there's just no way place. that they could have survived the radiation in the spacesuits <coughs> that they were wearing. Like, no one can explain that. Problem. It's not even a conspiracy. It's just fact. Look it up. What are you talking about, Vivek? Have you seen the shining? Have you become mates. With Donna. the stranger. Hey, not getting bored yet? Yeah, I passed the time doing some spring cleaning. I managed to take down that old plastic sheet at the back of the pool. That pool doesn't look bad. We need to sort out what we're doing here long term. I don't know how much more school I can miss. Oh yeah, sure. We can talk about it when I come back tonight. How was Moise's party? Becky said she was going. The other night? Nah, I couldn't get away from Dad. Oh, uh, you didn't go? Yeah, I didn't go either. Did she go oh. then? On By the way, you should take some time to explore this place. There's an upstairs area at the back which is worth a look. 
I'll see you later. Okay, interesting. This place were abandoned, wasn't it? Originally, but now we've invaded it. <laughs> Up for a walk? How are you feeling today? Everyone fine. seems to be asking me the same questions these days. I'm fine. That's good. You seemed a little unlike yourself the other night. Did I? Well, How are we going upstairs? Strange times. How's your sister? She's got she a date. Okay. <coughs> She's got a date tonight. Interesting. She's not sad. Um. What? No, she's all right. How does this guy know everything about us? He's got some powers. <coughs> cool. Were it Coca Cola, or it like a knockoff to avoid copyright? They do that in uh, games sometimes. <clears throat> Music. Is that a cigar? Hey, I know. Let me take a photo of you. You want to take a photo of me? Um, it'll be a lot. Yeah, come on. It'll be funny. Okay. Okay, cool. I've just got to free up some space on my phone. Ah, uh, no. Oh, we had that one earlier. What is that? That's, um, oh, that's her. I didn't recognise her without a uniform on. Got a few of, uh, That's a bit of a sad one. Skateboarding one. we back. enough <clears throat> I don't get what kind of phone she's got if she can only have like five pictures it's not a very good phone is it <clears throat> ah filters <laughs> we're going to be making tiktok videos next folks I don't think he'd like me to put them on. <laughs> I know you're not normal. You've got kooky abilities. Why are you staying here? Right now, I'm happy where I am. What if we let you go? Would you drop us in? What is he? If you didn't think I would, you would have no reason to keep me here. You like being like this, me, don't you? How does it make you feel? No, you don't. Enough of your super intense questions. I want to know about you. What do you want to know? Are you even human? Are you a human being? Like me? I'm very much like you. Do you fancy me? <laughs> Take that as a yes. Oi! What's so funny? I'm enjoying our time together. Do you like Becky? Not in the way you mean. Okay. Let's play a game. Have you heard of word association? 
I'll say a word, and then you say what it makes you think of. Ready? Okay, I'm ready. Home. Here. Sex. Essential. Death. Unnecessary. That's my mum's favourite song. It's <laughs> lovely. Um, it's been a while. Confiding in the stranger, eh, Donna? Should be fine. Why do you think that? This is all very strange. People are frail. If she's old, your mother will probably die. Prick. Prick. Have I done something wrong? You shouldn't say that. <laughs> Even if it's true, it's not very nice to say. That someone might die. Look who's back! It's Vivek. Hey. You okay? Is he doing his shift at the chippy? Yeah. Come on, let's go for a walk. I take it you weren't a fan of my attempts at interior decorating. No, I love that. It made me smile. I figured if the three of us are spending more time here. How's I Becky? Don't know. Not heard from her since Moise's party. Since then, that that were a while ago, wasn't it? Probably shouldn't have said that. She did, actually. Oh. So she did ask him out, and then what? How are we going upstairs? <laughs> Where are you going, Vivek? Why do you care about Becky asking me out? Is that why you're upset? Mm, no. no. Not really. Something else is bugging me. I mean, I don't see why you'd care about who I went out with. Mum, mum, mum. It's mum. Unless you do care who I go out with. Oh, just listen, will ya? Sorry. What's up with your mum? Just give me a hug, yeah? <laughs> well, well. So that's... So she was annoyed that Becky <laughs> was going to ask him out. <coughs> make up for lost time. Maybe we can make up for lost time. What do you mean? I don't want to be alone tonight. You move fast, don't you, Donna? Just watch out for the stranger. Don't want him watching. I know, he looks pissed off. Alright, that's that one. So, um, yeah, so double episode there, because that. Mina episode was pretty short, and yeah, no, no big reveals uh, really in the story. It's still developing it, but I'm, I'm enjoying it quite a bit. So I'll leave that on there, folks, and see you next time.